mr james firstly i want to congratulate and recognise thalidomide victims across europe and campaigners for their dogged persistence in their campaign. in may two thousand and fifteen nine months ago meps of every political group here in the eu parliament insisted that a solution be found to the scandal of the lack of action on the urgent needs of thalidomide victims a solution to a problem that is approaching sixty years old. during those sixty years the german government system and the pharmaceutical company concerned have deployed every possible prevarication and procrastination tactic to avoid addressing those needs. all these organisations should be absolutely ashamed of their actions resorting to every legal and administrative excuse loophole and delaying tactic to prevent a financial settlement. it is absolutely scandalous and an affront to human dignity that this situation continues. survivors many of them profoundly disabled they are still however human beings and they should be treated as such. they require an adequate and reasonable sum to help them cope with the daily challenges that life throws at them as they get older. their needs should not be ignored. for an institution that trumpets a minimum wage or a living wage or even human rights for the healthy and non disabled individuals why is it so supremely difficult to find a financial sum that will allow thalidomide victims to also live a normal life as best as their disability allows? I now call on the Commission, the Council and MEPs to censure the German government and state and the commercial interests concerned for this inhumane, cruel and unnecessary delay. Nine months is bad enough 60 years is inexcusable. Thank you.